If you'd like to follow along with your own Hashem devotional, please click the link in the description below. October 1st, we're reading from page 301, Hashem, the war against the name. If the world hates you, ye know that it hated me before it hated you. Remember the word that I said unto you, the servant is not greater than his Lord. If they have persecuted me, they will also persecute you. If they have kept my saying, they will keep yours also. But all these things will they do unto you for my name's sake, because they know not him that sent me. John 15, 18 and 20 through 21. Since the birth of the church, a war has been waged to deny, ridicule, blaspheme, curse, and discredit the name of Jesus. After the healing of the lame man, Peter boldly declared the power which brought the miraculous healing was in Jesus' name, Acts 3, 16. Peter and John were thrown in prison. The following day, when asked by the council by what power or name the lame man had been healed, Peter again boldly proclaimed that it was by the name of Jesus, Acts 4, 10. This was the beginning of a spiritual war that has continued throughout the centuries. Consider that more than 70 million Christians were martyred during the course of history simply because they refused to deny the name of Jesus. The war against Jesus' name has continued. During one president's administration, prayers in the White House and at government functions were first vetted and approved for fear of offending others from different religious persuasions. One pastor who delivered a prayer chose to avoid mentioning Jesus. He explained, for some strange reason, the word Jesus is like pouring gasoline on fire for some people in this country. You learn how to work around that. Are you fearlessly taking a stand for Jesus and declaring his name? Regardless of growing opposition, hostility, or persecution, we must not compromise but stay true to the name of Jesus. Continue to boldly and proudly proclaim his name. Jesus said that whosoever is ashamed of him and his words, of him shall the Son of Man be ashamed when he shall come in his own glory. Luke 9, 26. Make this declaration. Lord Jesus, I will remain true to your name and will confess and proclaim it wherever I go. The Hashem Devotional Book is now available. Receive your copy today. Click the product link in the description below. May the angels of the Lord encamp around you and answer all your longings.